everywhere. A silent protest took place at the Manitoba Legislative Building Monday afternoon. Over 100 people were present protesting public health orders. Protests and rallies were planned across the country Monday by a group calling themselves Canadian Frontline Nurses. Originally planned to be held in part outside hospitals, many locations were changed over the weekend, including here in Manitoba, where protesters met outside the legislative building. Everybody has the right to protest, and they're doing it at the ledge, which is where everybody goes to protest, so I, it's a step in the right direction, yeah. Jay Hall was upset after protesters rallied outside the Health Sciences Centre last week in Manitoba. Hall says he spoke with people who missed appointments and others who had a hard time entering the hospital as a result. A member of my staff, his mom, had a hard time getting in the hospital. Uh, there were she, people shouting at her, swearing at her, threw paper at her, uh, and then she got shoved uh, as she was getting across the street here. As a result, Hall and other Manitobans, including Blue Bomber John Rush, volunteered to escort patients through protesters if they rallied outside the hospital like they originally planned. After standing silent for a period of time, protesters in Winnipeg marched to City Hall with a police escort. Meanwhile, Justin Trudeau drawing a line in the sand Monday, saying this if elected on September 20th. The Liberal Party of Canada, if re-elected to form government, will make it a criminal offense to block access to buildings that provide health care, whether that's hospitals, clinics, abortion clinics, uh, pharmacies, testing centers. It is not okay that across the country, hospitals are having to put up barricades today to manage the mobs coming their way. City news reporters in Quebec say protesters in small numbers still rallied outside a hospital Monday, but didn't appear to block anyone from going inside. 48 hours before today's protest in Winnipeg, Sean Zimmer shared in a Facebook post alongside the location change this message. We do not want to cause delay to anyone requiring health care. We do not want to cause more divide. We want to put a stop to the divide, so we have moved away from the hospital for Monday's protest. In Winnipeg, Mark Newfeld, City News.